Hello and welcome to another tutorial. This tutorial is going to be on correcting some signal errors. So primarily what we're going to be using here is our signal deviation correction, uh, which is here, sorry, and interpolation. I'm going to start right off with our uh, some example files here. And so in this example file, I'm using the one ceramic jar filled with jewelry. And we have here our interpolation icon and our correct all deviating signals icon, which is just signal correction. Now, as we can see here, over on we have our on our display here, it appears that we have one large signal from our side view and from our perspective view, which is skewing our visit vision, our our image. In this here this is the corner where it is. So by moving our arrow keys to the left our left arrow, up and down arrow, right arrow, you see we create crosshairs. Under the uh, correct signal, signal correction here, we can correct the value under the crosshairs only automatically, or we can come here and correct all values automatically. Uh, both of them may be an option depending on what you're looking at. Now if you have very very strong signals like this you may want to try just the automatic mode which I'm going to correct all values automatically my values for this particular are set at 8 and 3 I hit OK and there's a target okay but in the instance where we only have one area I'm going to move the crosshairs all the way down to the very corner I'm going to come here correct the value under the crosshair only and that also does it the reason we have this error here under this crosshair, or right hand corner, is when you first say OK, um, you select uh, to start a ground scan. Do you want to start your first line now? And you hit yes. And then you start walking. At this moment, you, sh you shook the antenna. So it wobbled, and therefore you have this signal when you started your pass. To correct it, we just take out that one area. You'll have it area. You will have it here and we'll have it over here at the end when you stop it. This is not always at the end, but on the older units it will because you have to physically turn it off. And it's not automatic anymore. Okay, so this is in this essence here of correcting the signal here. Let's go and uh, pull another example here. Iron box with silver and gold coins. Okay, so looking here it appears we have the same thing at the bottom. Can you see that one spike here? That's one right here. So we can actually come in here and correct that right there at the value there. And we have this. So let's look at it sideways. We have this. Now, if you wanted to go further and say, do I have one or two targets? Well, many times when you're scanning, you may have multiple targets. You may have one target. But if we wanted to get a picture to say, well, let's see what it looks like. We'll go to interpolation. And now it shows our target being one or two. It doesn't make a difference. It could be 50, actually. But now it shows, here's my, here's my area. This is my target right here. This is what I'm looking at. So if I'm going to go and dig a hole, I pretty much guess I'm going to dig a hole somewhere in this area right here. Because this is where... I'm looking. And that's what interpolation will do for you. So going back to the very beginning, we can correct the error either automatically to help this appear a little better or correct it just under the crosshairs. Helps to clarify it. Or you can use the interpolation. The interpolation is basically going to blend in many of the values together whereas the signal correction is actually going to correct the signal. See how that is completely gone there? It completely corrected that signal to the background. It neutralized it. So that's basically how it works. Again, if you have any need for help, just come over to www.okm-usa.com. Uh, we have a live chat there. And we usually staff it five days a week. If not, you can email me at fcasser, that's F-C-A-S-S-E-R, at okm-gmbh.de. 
or you can contact our office of the factory for additional help and service. Thank you very much.